HoloLens is Microsoft's mixed reality headset, and as in the name, mixes together augmented reality and virtual reality into one seamless headset. Basically how it works is you put it on and it kind of turns your, the world that you're in into like this virtual space where you can open like holograms or you have like programs open. It's hard to explain, but you can see in the footage behind me of what it's like. So while the HoloLens hasn't really come out yet, all they're selling is just development kits and they're going for thousands of dollars, Microsoft said that they're already working on a HoloLens 2. So HoloLens 2 is pretty much going to be the, almost the same thing to the first HoloLens, but it's going to have much faster power inside of it. In fact, it'll have a custom AI chip designed by Microsoft themselves, and that chip is known as a co-processor. You can see here, this is the image of the processor. It looks pretty tiny and you can see compared to a normal human hand, it can fit in the size of your palms easily. So what do I think about the possible HoloLens 2? Well I think that Microsoft should just focus on the first HoloLens before they actually come out with the second one because to be fair, while this is interesting technology, I think you should just focus on one product if it's like taking the center stage because I don't really think there's much else like the HoloLens. But I mean, if the first HoloLens isn't really finished, then you shouldn't be really working on a second one. Sure, you can maybe plan for it, but you probably shouldn't be like, you know, actually developing it. Now, to be fair, they're just saying that it could be, it could use, you know, this custom AI chip and they're just talking. They're not really, you know, just building it. But I still think that their main focus right now should be HoloLens 1. Because this is very interesting technology where you just, it might even be the future where you just put on a HoloLens and instead of just sitting in front of a computer all day, you just like open up a browser where you do some research and kind of like have virtual mo And technically, if the HoloLens is done right, it could take up majority of what you do on your computer. What I think would be interesting is that if you had a HoloLens and you could actually like watch a movie without a TV. That would be, it's probably gonna be one of the things that you can do when the whole lens officially launches, where you just like have this virtual TV and you're kind of just like in the real world, just staring at a wall, but in the actual whole lens world, you're just staring at a TV that doesn't exist, but it's playing a movie. So that would be pretty interesting. But again, I don't think Microsoft needs another whole lens yet. I would expect that if the first whole lens takes off, they should probably then start work on the HoloLens 2, uh, like a maybe a year down the road, but they should really focus on the first HoloLens if they really want to get the most success out of it. Really, the only competitors I can think of to the HoloLens would be something like phones, where you have like augmented reality cameras, like Pokemon Go and all that. And remember how that was such a big deal when the original 3DS launched? Yeah, now they just pretty much stop talking about all that. So, let's just wrap this up. Do I think that the first HoloLens is going to be successful? Yeah, I think eventually when it does come out, it's going to be a pretty interesting product. And I think if Microsoft does do it right and just pushes it to its absolute limits, then it could be a very interesting piece of tech and it could actually, you know, you might just see people having a HoloLens everywhere they go. Do I think HoloLens 2 would be successful if the first one was? Yeah, I think that they're probably just gonna focus on HoloLens 2 after the first one's hardware, you know, just kind of dies out. But HoloLens 2 could probably capitalize off of the success of the first one, and if done right, could even, like, reinvent how we use, like, how we do anything. Maybe they might even make a Xbox HoloLens, you know? Like, you know what I mean. That, that would be a pretty interesting, but... I still think that Microsoft should just focus on the first HoloLens and just not, you know, just already dive into a second one and a third one and a fourth one and fifth one and a sixth one when the first one hasn't even come out yet. Well, it has come out, but it's going for thousands of dollars and it's just a development kit. So what are your thoughts on the HoloLens? Please leave your thoughts on this in the comment section below. If you have any articles that you think I should talk about, please private message me on YouTube with the link to the article. And if you ask, you might get a shout out for it and see you.